You like nice things. Bro, let me hold your rent money. Probably not. Let's get let's get into it though. So y'all heard me er earlier. We made s'mores, and I told y'all like, man, I made I, I never made s'mores, but I had it before. You feel me? I had s'mores before. Um, it wasn't a pre-made s'more, but it was made for me. I'm about to tell y'all a little story time about when I went on a cabin trip. You know, I went on a cabin trip with my godmom. Now y'all know I I never call my second mom my godmom. Mm -hmm. My my birth mom, not my godmom. Nas mom, not my godmom. I have a godmom. You feel me? I have a godmom. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell y'all about her. Um, basically, my birth mom, my birth mom's best friend, is my godmom. Y'all know that. Y'all know that person that got money. It, like you go to their house and it's like, damn, bro, I got roaches. I come to your house and y'all got a snack cabinet. My mom take the snacks in her room. Like, y'all have a snack cabinet. That's how crazy it get, bro. You feel me? But, bro, that's my godmom. Like, I rarely see her. I rarely see her, too. So, it was like, yo, every time I seen her, I was like, my mom used to hate when I asked her for stuff, too. She used to hate when I asked her for stuff. I'd be like, yo, can I have $5? Stop asking for her. Stop asking her for shit. Uh, she, she'd be like, oh, you want me to take you to the store? I'd be like, yes. My mom pulled me to the side. Yo, next time, don't let it happen again. Like, my mom used to be super mad. But I was, I was, I was asking anyway because it's like, come on, we poor. Like, let her help us the fuck out. You feel me? Um, but one time, my, my godmom, like, yo, you feel me? She like, yo, I'm going on this cabin trip. Do you want to go? I'm like, what's a cabin trip, right? And she like, yeah, cabin trip. We basically go out to the woods. I'm like, no, not the woods. She like, no, it's a resort. So basically, it's a resort. You go out to the cabin. You live in like a, a it's an all wood house, you know, basically that's what a cabin is. And then it's other people's in, in different cabins near you. So you're not in the middle of the woods out of nowhere. Um, I, would, I wouldn't have went. I watch a lot of movies. So personally, the cabin trips be like, like I don't know why white people pack up with their family, throw their bags on, drive to a random cabin in, in the middle of nowhere with no other houses no fuck no it wasn't it wasn't none of that i wouldn't agree to that i would have easily went home the next day or called my mother um i don't know how she was getting there though she don't have a car i kind of was fucked anyway but anyway um we go to the cabin and it's multiple cabins like you can see it's basically neighbors you got neighbors you feel me like you walk a couple feet, it's another cabin. You walk another feet, it's, a, it's another cabin. You see people outside, like, during the day, it's whamming, bro. You could go canoeing on the lake, anything like that, bro. You feel me? It's super fire. So, it's it's like a little, it's, like, it's a little vacation spot. It's a resort. You feel me? You got the workers. They got the dark blue shirts on. Um, It's called uh, Cabin, Cabin Corral something. Cabin something with a C. Cabin something. And they, um, they the workers and shit. You could just ask them, like, yo... Can I use the canoe or or where where can I find food around the area? Or yo, the AC's not working, you know, shit like that. So they walking everywhere. We get there. Yo, the first day we get there, I got my own room. Bro, vacation with her used to always feel good, bro. I'm not gonna lie, until I moved here, I never really had my own room room. You feel me? Like, let me just take y'all through it all, bro. Let me take y'all through it all. Look. Oh, I no, I'm not, I'm lying, I'm lying. Uh, when my, when my birth mom, when my birth mom, before my little brother was born, I had my own room. I had my own room for like two years. We got evicted, back to grandma house, shared the room with my mom and my little brother. Then we moved somewhere else, shared the room with my mom and my little brother. Like, we was, we was poor to the point where it's like, yo, my mom and my brother, we all sleep in the same room. Uh, what else? Like, when I was in, when y'all used to see, like, the ceilings, the brick ceilings, I was in a room with Nas, we shared the room. I didn't. I didn't really count the. I didn't really count the basement because that joint was like a cubicle. Like I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I don't even know how I was dancing in that bitch. It was super small. If you count that, you count that. But then again, bro, it didn't really count, bro, because it didn't count because, bro. First of all, what if I wanted to hang a poster? You can't hang a fucking poster. It's it's, it's pink. It's pink shit. It's, it's it's you. You got the um, you got the shit coming out the wall. Bro, tape don't even stick to those fucking walls. I don't know what's wrong with them walls. You can't drill shit into them. You can't tape shit. You can't put no stickers up. I'm like, okay, you know what? That's fine. You feel me? I, I ain't have a ceiling. It's like, yo, this just just like a just like a you know. And mind you, I didn't been so fucking poor. I didn't been so fucking poor that I was fine with it. I enjoyed my space, but it's it's just certain things you gotta know. 
with the room that you in. Bro, it don't matter if I was in that room having a conversation. I know Nas could hear me right ne right through them walls. Because I could hear Nas. Y'all know when he be streaming, I hear him. I'm streaming, he hear me. The walls thin as shit. I can't even bust it up on the phone, be sneaky. Yeah, what you say? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, nigga, hear me. You feel me? Like, you know? It, so I didn't really count that. It was too many flaws. It was too many flaws. It was too many flaws. I couldn't really get customizable. This is like, yo, right now I just moved, if you don't know. We moved from the basement. I got my own crib, but it's like, you know, this is my first room. You feel me? But back to the point. Back to the point. When I was out on them cabin trips, nigga, when I was out on them cabin trips, bro, it used to feel like the best, bro. It felt like the best because at the end of the day, bro, she used to always give me my own room. Bro, I used to love the moms. I used to love, like, bro, my god mom used to say, what? Uh, my, my god mom used to be like, what? Sleep in the same room? No, boys boys and girls got to be separate. Not at my grandma's house. They had us lapping up like slaves. Bro, it, me, my boy cousin, boy cousin, boy cousin. Or if, if it's girls too, the girls get the bed. Fellas, hit that floor. What? Sex is at its finest. Sex is at its finest. We lapped up like slaves. Bro, I ain't never had my own. Bro, I was so used to doing the bare minimum. It was like, yo, when she gave me my own room, it felt crazy. Bro, even when I had my own room for them little two years that I told y'all about, my mom used to, like, not let me close the door. I couldn't do certain shit. Y'all, the day I got here, I painted my room. This room painted. I painted this shit. I, 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 you just love the freedom. Even if it's like, yo. Like, even if it's on a type of time, like, you get your own room. It's like, if you get the customizable, it's like, bro, I don't know, bro. Like, I get to really do what I, I want. You feel me? But when I went to that John, she let me close the door. You feel me? She let me close the door. You know, I'm doing my own thing alone time. My mom so bipolar, like my real mom, she's so bipolar, if I'm too quiet, she come in, open this door, what's your problem, what you doing, you being sneaky, what's going on, eyes closed, talk, if I'm too loud, shut the fuck up, you can't fucking chill, you never can chill, shut the fuck up, slap my head, I'm tired of hearing you, I'm asleep, I work, all this, okay, alright, <laughs> okay, bro, I'm in there quiet, my mom, Bro, my god mom knock on the door like she ain't pay for the whole cabin. Doop, 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 doop. Peek her head in. You okay? Yes, I'm okay. Okay, we gonna eat. You can come down and get some if you want. If you don't eat that, I'll order you something else. Wow. Wow. You know what my mom used to tell me? I'm cooking spaghetti again. I don't give a fuck if you want it or not. You gonna eat it. And if you don't eat it, it's leftovers. And that's the only thing that's left for you to eat. So eat it if you want. <laughs> <laughs> That's how my mom treated me like a fuck like a fucking joke. Like a fucking joke. I'm tired of I'm tired of noodles. I'm tired of peanut butter and jelly. I'm tired of spaghetti. You feel me? I hate it. I hate it. She said, yo, I'm cooking if you don't want it. We could order you something else. Wow. That shit felt different. So day one, it's already feeling good, man. I'm feeling too good. I'm feeling too good. Day two coming around, she let me sleep in late. She woke me up. She said, hey, we got breakfast, but you was asleep. Come down, eat breakfast. You got to start waking up early. I don't want you to be, you're not going to grow. That's probably why I didn't grow, man. I've been, I've been staying up all night all my life, but, you know, I am 6'3", so. That's a little tall enough. But anyways, I, I, I go down, I eat breakfast, everything good. It feel, it feel all good. It feel fine. You feel me? It, it's all sturdy. Boom. This one shit get crazy. Day three come, right? Day three come. And my aunt say, oh, my God, I think it would be a good idea for you to go try out for the camp with the other kids. And as soon as you go with the other kids, like, you, you can interact with them. They have a little program. They're going to teach you how to start a fire. They're going to teach you. They're going to teach you how to do this. They're going to teach you how to do that. All this other shit, bro. All this other shit. So I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm like, oh. 
that's nice. I'm like, maybe let's just chill a little bit because I'm the type of kid. Boom, bro. I was in my room on, on my tablet searching up how to draw Goku step by step. I was in that bitch watching, watching uh, DDG. I'm in that bitch. I'm in that bitch playing with the curtains. I'm in there seeing why I went, that thing that's behind the door when you flink it. Dun, 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 dun. I'm playing with that, bro. I'm having a time of my life by myself. She said, go interact with the other kids. Wow. And I don't really want to tell her no because she never tell me no. She never tell me no. So I'm like, I'm like, um, how long is it? And she said, all you got to do is go there uh, every day for three hours. I'm like, damn, it's only three hours. I'm like, all right. I'm like, okay, I got you. She, okay, thank you so much. I love you. She hit me with that. Just before, bro, I'm sitting there. I'm about to say, I, I don't really want to go. She, she, I love you. I'm like, damn. She put the cherry on top. I'm like, okay, I love you too. I'm like, fuck it. It's three hours. Y'all, the three hours started at 9 a.m. The three hours started at 9 a.m. Why are we waking up at 9 a.m. on vacation? Why are we waking up at 9 a.m. on vacation? Fuck them kids! What the fuck? 9 a.m. And then when I get there, I find out the first day is orientation. That's when you put your information and you put your consent form and just in case you get hurt. After that, you're there for a whole six hours. I'm back in school. What the fuck, mom? No. Oh. Fuck! And she had a man, too. She had a man. I know she probably just wanted me going so they could little, get a little humpy. I know she wanted me going so they could get humpy. And it's like, yo, if he gonna fuck you, he gonna fuck you. I don't mind it. I can't really tell you to stop dating a nigga, but don't, don't, make, me go to, don't make me go to camp. Come on. You gonna treat me like one of the little dogs. Come on, I'm supposed to be big dog. She always told me. You a, you, 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 you a big guy. You a... You 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 growing up? You a big man, and then treat me like a low ass bitch. Nine a.m. there for six hours. I'm like, damn, bro, y'all trying to fuck that bad? I was pissed. Anyways, bro, orientation day, I knock it out. I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all as kids. It was a stage with me. It's like, yo, I really want to meet people because I really know how to interact with people. Then it was like, yo, I already got my friends, so I don't want to meet people. Then it became, bro, kids are fucking evil. Kids are evil, bro. Like, kids are genuinely evil. Like, that's why I be so surprised when I be so surprised when I find a genuine kid because kids are genuinely evil, bro. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Like, they're they're genuinely mean for no fucking reason. Yeah, yeah, mom. Like, I understand your parents have an influence on it, but some kids genuinely mean as fuck, bro. I hate kids. I genuinely do. I, I don't want to meet new kids. They piss me off. It's like, what the fuck are you doing, bro? It make you want to body slam them. Bro, I got a little cousin. He's three. The nigga broke the TV. The nigga grabbing the TV. Stop. No. No. Pulling the TV. Breaks the fucking TV while I'm watching anime. That's the nut shit that be going. It's like, bro. And then if I hit you with this body shot, I'm going to change your whole existence around. Young boy, chill the fuck out before I stomp the shit out you. Like, bro, they be having smart-ass mouths at young age. Yo, you going to spill the cup? I got it. You going to spill the cup? I got it. <laughs> spill the cup. Yo, pee right there. You pee in the hole. You pee. In, and then you know you know what the excuse is? They don't know no better. They don't know no better. Oh, but he know the, he know the curse when you not around, though. He know to sneak snacks when you ain't looking. But he don't know how to piss in the hole. You don't know how to piss in the toilet. But you but you know how to say bitch. You pee in the bed. You pee in the bed, but you want you want to eat lobster. Fuck no. I'm not falling for your shit. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I got a beef with babies, bro. And if you think, bro. Let me keep my shit to myself. I got a beef with babies, bro. And I'm going to keep it a buck, bro. I don't tolerate kids, bro. I don't. If you kid, bro, I, if I ever babysit your kid and he tests me, I'm fucking him up. I'm going to switch his whole his whole thinking system around. I'm going to hit him with a fucking liver shot. Sit him right down. Real rat. He catching it the same way. 
Twist the motherfucking lips when they act up. Twist the lips is crazy. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Just how you did Larry Kid. Yeah, bro. I hate kids, bro. They so fucking, like, they do so much. But, um, I don't know, man. I think, I think genuinely, like, it's a 50 50 chance your kid might be mean or a little evil. If you don't put in overtime, I think that's what it is. I think if you don't put in overtime, then like your kid, it's a 50 50 chance they might just be like super nutty. You feel me? But, anyways, let's get back to it. First day after, uh, first day after orientation is day one. We, we here, we here for two weeks, bro. So this shit about to feel like a job. Day one, I get there and we learn how to start a fire. I'm like, okay. We learn how to start a fire. I don't know nobody. I don't want to talk to nobody. It's this one nigga next to me. His name's Zaire. And he like, yo, bro, I'm trying to start the fire. And, and he giving me the vibes like, yeah, bro, your skin complexion is black, but you're not black, bro. He really talking to me like, yo, bro. You somebody ever speak? And it's like, this ain't how you speak. He like, bro, they trying to get us to start the fire. I'm like, yeah. I'm listening to the guy. He bro, I don't want to do this shit for real. Yeah, me neither. I'm trying to start now. I'm starting a fire. He, yo, I see we leave. No, my mom said don't leave. Yo, bro, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how to do this. I stand up. I walk away from him. I sit next to the bad bitch. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. It's that simple, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I don't know how to do this. I'm gonna keep it a buck, bro. If, a, if you talking to a nigga and he hitting you with the, yeah, no, nah. yeah, no, nah, yeah, yeah. Stop trying to fucking conversate, nigga. He trying to be rebellious for nothing. We don't even got a, we don't even got a reason to hate this shit yet. It might be fun. Shut the fuck up. I'm trying to find light in it. And you just being super fucking like, he just like cooking me. So, you feel me? I move. You feel me? The first day, actually fun. I start having fun. They said, yo, pair up with a partner. I paired up with the baddest bitch in the building. Of course, you know me. Um, Personally, I knew that other niggas in the building liked the bad bitch. But I was going, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm from Philly. You feel me? I'm from Philly. I feel like as a, a nigga from Philly, you know what you're doing when it's a bad bitch in a room. And I just was like, yo, you want to pair up? She like, yeah. She had no reason to deny me, bro. I came down there with a haircut and a good-ass fit. Bro, my mom used to, like, my mom used to buy me shit here and there. But my God, mom, she had me drip the fuck out. I was looking like Bow Wow in 2007, nigga. And I was matching, bro. With the haircut, I know she was looking like, damn, bro, he's super, he's super sexy. Because I'm looking at her like that. But I paired up with her or whatever. She wasn't really talkative. Was she light-skinned? No, she was dark-skinned. You feel me? But, you know, I wasn't really worrying about dating her and shit. I wasn't worrying about dating her. Day two come and shit. And the nigga that's always talking to me, I'm like, yo, bro, you know where the pencil's at? You feel me? This time we're indoors. We're, we're drawing. I'm like, yo, you know where the pencil's at? Your real mom don't know her colors. She know her colors, but my real mom not materialistic. So she ain't, she ain't, she ain't drip me out like black wise. Like she'll buy me what I want. It would take for me to say like, yo, I want this mom and drip myself out. If it was up to her, my shit would have all been fucking whatever was the cheapest. I probably would have been wearing, I don't know, bro. I don't know. Then you have the Philly low cut. Yeah, I had the Philly low cut. As long as it's fresh. Yeah, it, it, I mean, maturing, maturing right now is realizing it don't have to be designer. But, like, bruh, my second mom made me so materialistic, bro. I was like, damn. Yeah, she got me the outfits. It wasn't the drip, though. You feel me? That she, Yeah, she was she was more in the type tip. Like, yo, is your back cool? Because you got a jacket. And that joint was big as shit. Went to my kneecaps to my head. Like, she was buying me big-ass coats for... For winter, for summer, I got regular cargoes. You feel me? Big ass snapback hats, uh, Abercrombie Air, Air sweatpants. You know, just like you know, real regular shit. And it was fun too. It was super fun. 
But you know, when I walk up to my friends and they dripped out and they like, yeah, right. We got the we got the drippy shit, and I'm like, yeah, bro, I'm getting it too. They're like, oh yeah. You know, two weeks pass. Yo, right? When your when your when your new shoes coming in? Yeah, them Jones in the house. Oh, wear them tomorrow. Tomorrow come. I'm not coming out. You feel me? And that's me personally. And I know I'm I'm wrong for lying. I'm sorry, but I gotta do what I gotta do to protect me and my peace. That's all. I gotta do what I do. I gotta do what I gotta do to protect me and mine. And 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 I'm probably wrong from lying. I'm just doing me, bro. Anyways, back to the story time. I asked the boy who was talking a lot, right? I asked the boy who was talking a lot. I said, yo, bro, can you pass me the pencil? He like, yeah, I can pass you the pencil, bro. I got you right now. You feel me? He grabbed the pencil. He passed to me. I said, damn, thank you, bro. I said, bro, you actually cool. I'm not going to lie. The, uh, the first day we had, I wasn't really feeling it. But, you know, if you want to come over here with us, you could come over here. So he like, oh, see no more, bro. So he come over there and shit. And I could tell he really trying to be down. I could tell he really trying to be down, bro. Bro, we all working, bro. We all working. And we talking about girls and boys. You feel me? We being a little. We, be, we, 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 we being a little fresh. We being a little fresh. It ain't even fresh, bro. Because I. Oh! It ain't even fresh, man. Because I'm not going to lie. Nowadays, niggas is. Niggas like kids is humping at 11, 12. I just dropped my phone. Niggas is humping at 11, 12 years old. You feel me? We like four, 14. I'm trying to fuck. You feel me? I'm going to keep it a buck. I was trying to fuck on some. You know? You know? But not at this trip, but period. I was trying to fuck on some. But, you know, we we was being, we was being a little, we was being a little, we was talking about, you know, boyfriends and girlfriends if we ever dated and shit like that, you know? And we talking about that. We're not talking about sex. We just talking about dating. You feel me? So it ain't that fresh. You feel me? We just talking about dating. You know what this nigga going to say when I invited him to the table? He like, yeah, I'm not going to lie. Y'all ever kiss somebody under the table, though? Everybody goes silent, and it's like, bro, I brought you to this table. How, how dare you embarrass me like that? Why these people don't they, these people don't know me, but they don't know you more than they don't know me. I've been with them for two days. We we locked in a little bit. I I brought you over here and I told them I know you and you gonna say that. I say yo, bro. Chill out a little bit. He like oh my fault. Everybody, everybody, everybody go, uh, you feel me? Everybody go back to talking. Then we start, we, we start getting a little fresher. I'm like, yo, speaking about kissing, like, I never kiss nobody. I'm scared to kiss people. Like, oh, what the, people just be out here kissing. The pretty girl, like, yeah, I, I had one kiss. Just that three, we talking about it. He, y'all talking about kisses. I be grabbing asses. Y'all ever played catch a girl, freak a girl? The pretty girl gonna say, "What's catch a girl, freak a girl?" I said nothing. It's 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 like tag, but it's not it's not it's not a game you should play. It's 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 for older people. He what? No, it's for all ages. I'm like, bro, it's not chill. He nah, bro. Listen, bro, I really play the game. That means you don't play it. I said, bro, I know the game. I know what the game is. I played it before. So now I just put myself in the I just put myself in the circle. I'm like, I played it before, bro. Chill. I know what it is. Don't say it. They don't know, and that's not a game for here. He, bro, no, trust me, bro. You got to be bold about it, bro. Trust me. I got you. He touched my shoulder. I'm like, bro, chill. He, bro, I got you, bro. He, look, let me tell y'all. I'm like, chill, bro. He said, yeah, basically all the girls run. When you run to the girls, you catch them. You hold them down and you freak them. I said, no, nah, that's not how. That's not how it really go. You feel me? That's 
he just says that he just exaggerated. You feel me? I'm like basic. I'm like basically. She well, the name basically does say catch a girl, freak a girl. I'm like, no, you're not. That's not what the game. That's not how I play. I don't know. I don't know him. I don't know him. Tell us more about this game. I say, yo, tell us more. Tell us more. I'm like, that sounds crazy. Bro, I, I switch. Bro, I completely switch stands. I'm like, oh, no. So so now after he said, yeah, uh, no, you don't actually pull the clothes down. You just hump and then you run. Everybody be laughing and it, and it, and it be funny. I'm like, oh, I'm like, that sounds crazy, bro. I would never play that. He, You just said you play it. I'm like, I don't play that version. He, what version do you play? I said, catch a girl, freak a girl, me. If... If if somebody dress up, bro, lying my ass off. I said somebody dress up and they they freaky. It could be anybody, a boy or a girl. You catch them. You catch the freak. You catch the freak like a monster. And he no, bro, you lying because when when you said you play catch a girl, freak a girl, you touched my shoulder and you basically said that you played it, bro. You basically said you catch the girls. You know what I'm talking about. So how you gonna say you catch the men too? I said yo, bro, chill the fuck out. Chill the fuck out, bro. Now, now, now the girl, she's smiling. She, wow, I didn't know you was like that, Rod. I'm like, I'm not like that. I'm not. You feel me? He don't got no manners. He don't got no man, Bro, these, though, that game is for the tree sheets. Chill. He not chilling. Like, you're wilding. I'm like, bro, shut the fuck up. He, oh, my fault. Look, after that, bro, the nigga ain't get invited to my table again. The next day come, the nigga think he was already invited to the table. I say, hey, I called you? He, no, nah, he ain't called me. What you mean? I said, what you walk over for then? He, oh, I want to chill. Nigga, you think you about to chill? You think you about to chill after the shit you just pulled? After you gonna embarrass me? Mm. Fuck no. I told the nigga. Alright, bro, you can chill because I don't wanna be mean. For real, for real, bro. The the cute girl don't like mean niggas. Like I could already tell that. You can scan niggas' badges and see their reaction based off like mean stuff and how bad they take it, you feel me? So I already know she don't like mean people, so I'm like, yo, I'm going to talk to bro at the class. At the class, I let bro know. I'm like, yo, bro, I'm going to keep it a buck, bro. I don't want to be your friend, bro. Like, when when you see me somewhere, bro, let me be me. Like, I'll leave from them, but don't be, don't be like, near me, bro. You making it uncomfortable. Now, the, the day I go home that night, I tell my god mom, I'm like, yo, I'm like, mom, this boy in my class, I'm telling her everything. She, oh, my God, he said that. I'm like, yes. She, you not supposed to say that. She real cool. Like, she cool as shit. She like, no, he was not supposed to say that in front of the girl. I'm like, yes. I'm like, yo, just that in the third, all this. So I tell him I don't want to be his mans now, right? The next day I come in, I said I don't want to be a mans. I didn't say we ops. I said, yo, bro, you can pass me a pencil because he always next to the pencils. Bro said, get up and get your own pencil. I looked at the nigga like, bet, nigga. I don't give a fuck. I walk up, I grab my pencil. I'm like, nigga, I grabbed the whole pencil case, and I moved it near me. The instructor like, hey, don't move the pencil thing. I said, bro, I asked bro to pass me a pencil. He gonna tell me no. I'm gonna keep it over here. I, I need pencils a lot. He mad as fuck. So now I'm like, oh, all right, it's beef then. Nigga gonna tell me get my own pencil. All right, fuck you. He never walked over to our table again. Next three days, nothing going on, nothing going on, bro. All this, bro. Long day, long day after camp. I go into my crib, bro. I go into my crib, I go into my room, I close my door. I'm looking for my tablet. I ain't have an iPad at the time. I had a Samsung tablet. At the time, Samsung still was trying to fight to be a competitor. Unfortunately, Samsung, y'all losing. Y'all been got dicked in the phone market, but, you know, some niggas had Samsung tablets. Some niggas had them. Niggas don't ain't ever got them bitches no more. Y'all losing. If you ain't got an iPad or iPhone, it ain't a device. That's crazy. 
Anyways, it was a Samsung tablet, bro. Uh, Samsung, yeah, they still got TV. I mean, but Apple don't got a TV. I'm just saying, Apple dicking them in the tablet department and the, um, the tablet and the phone department. It's like, damn. I remember, like, I remember, look, I, I used to be in school. I used to be in school, and they'd be like, yo, you got an Android. It's a Samsung, bro. And we used to chill. Like, we used to, oh, oh all right, you got a Samsung. Nah, nigga. Not no more. You got a Samsung phone. That shit still don't, that shit don't fly no more. You got a Samsung phone. That shit still turn up green, though, nigga. And you, and you stand, you, Apple do got a TV. Yeah, but I'm saying, Apple only dick and Samsung. In the phone department, in the tablet department. That's all. I'm saying, like, that's all they dicking them in. I got court watching the hub on YouTube on my tablet. Why was you watching Pornhub on YouTube? What are you doing? What the fuck? Anyways, bro, I go home one day after camp, bro. I go home one day after camp, and I'm like, hey, mom, did you see my tablet? She's like, no, check under your bed. Make sure you check thoroughly. So I'm like, I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm checking. I'm like, damn, where's my tablet? I'm looking everywhere. I'm looking. I'm like, I'm like what the fuck? I'm like, mom, it's not in here. She said, if I go in there and find it, you're right. I'm like, you're not going to find it. I checked everywhere. When I really can't find something, I say, y'all, I'm going to check everything. I start in the corner of the room, and I look under. I got to check every dimension of every square foot. I could not fucking find the tablet, bro. She go in there. She can't find it. She what? Because she bought it for me. So she know how important it is. She looking around. She can't find nothing. She like, you can use mine for tonight. But how did you lose your tablet? I'm like, I did not lose my tablet. I did not lose my tablet. I did not use, lose my tablet. Bro, I go to class the next day. Yo. This nigga, on a, this nigga, this nigga pull out a Samsung tablet. I'm like, yo, bro. Uh, people wishing me happy birthday. Damn, I forgot it was my birthday. Bro got a Samsung tablet. I'm like, yo, that's my tablet? He said, that's not your tablet. I said, bro, that's my fucking tablet. I look on the back, I got a writing that I put on it. I'm like, that's mine, I snatched it. Bro, socked me right in my mouth. Boom, get off my tablet. I said, nigga, you lost your mind? Boom, we start rumbling. Oh, we hashing it out. After we hashing it out, he said, fuck you. I'm like, fuck you. All this, we do a fight. Suspend it for two days. Both of us socked me right in my mouth, bust my lip. I said, pussy, what? I, bro, I throw them hard-ass joints. I throw them hard-ass joints, bro. Oh, no, my camera froze. All right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Y'all saw them Jones I, I threw earlier. That's them Jones right there. That's that's them. Oh, if this hit you, it's over. That's them Ryan Garcia, desperate Jones. That's them like, yo, if you get hit with this, it's over. A basic standard nigga not dodging that, you know. Fuck. The flashlight dropped and all that. I ain't squashing shit. Don't care. Jay-Z tell me do it. I'm going to tell them no.
It should work. That's what it is. Got him! Let's fucking go. Ugh. Ah, shit. My knee. Ninners. Ninners. Live on IG again or no? Nah. Alright, we good? Just sitting up last time. Damn, how did I have this shit sitting up? Happy birthday, thank you. Continue. Hold up, I gotta set the phone up so I can see chat, bro. Damn. Niggas don't be giving a fuck about nothing. I can say y'all dying. Nigga gonna say story time. Hold up, bro. Let me get the shit right. Let me get the angles right. Alright, there we go. Alright, boom. Where the mic at? Oh, there go the mic. Alright, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, boom I said, yo, that is my tablet Take the tablet The nigga socked me right in my mouth Bust my lip I said, pussy, throw the hangmaker Bow, hit him I'm not gonna lie, y'all I hit him with some hard shit If y'all really wanna know how I really fuck somebody up, bro You gotta be careful when you swing And when you see the open, bro You need to swing with everything in you You need to swing like, yo Even if he got his guard up even if he got his guard up, I'm going to punch through this joint. Like, I might break my hand how hard I'm about to hit this nigga. That's how all your punches got to feel. I'm throwing them joints. Boom! I know he feel that shit, bro. I know he feel that shit, bro. I'm hitting him. Ah, bah, bah, bah. A nigga ever, like, like, he's swinging. I'm swinging. Like, we swinging at the same time. But at the end of the day, it looked like we going at it. But it's more in the type of time, like, yo, when we both stop, you can tell, you can tell, like, who, who punches really was doing the work. After we was done, bro, after we was done, this nigga, this nigga holding his body, he coughing, <laughs> all this, I back up, I'm just breathing heavy. I'm like, yeah, bro, all of this, they break us up or whatever, we got suspended for two days, right? Stumbling. <laughs> she talk about stumbling. You know when you lose. You start feeling like a loser. You know when you lose. So we both get suspended for two days. My mom keep me in a joint. She like, yo, you shouldn't have been fighting. This, that, and the third. Like, that was nutty. I brought you to this trip, and you shouldn't have been doing that. I'm trying to tell my mom, like, yo, this nigga's wilding. You feel me? That's how it, that's like, yo, this nigga wild out. He took my, he took my, my uh, tablet. She like, you should have told the teacher. But at the end of the day, at around that time, bro, around that time, you did, first of all, first of all, first of all, when I'm outside and I'm with my friends on the internet and everything, niggas is saying, yo, don't rat, nigga, or we gonna kill you. And then you telling me, tell your teacher. Why would I tell my teacher instead of punching this nigga in his face? First of all, that's what I felt like doing. I never felt like, oh, you took my tablet? I'm telling the teacher. That's fake. Why the fuck is it freezing? Oh, 
water. Spit, put this shit in the cooler. Put a fan on it. I don't got no fan. Because we got central air. Alright. We good? Alright, yeah, we good. Alright, boom. Suspend it. My mom's snapping on me. She like, yeah, you got suspended. I took you on this trip. I'm going to keep it a buck. I think she got used to every time I go to, to the school thing, she go out with her nigga. And to be frankly honest, I kept it a buck with her. I'm like, yo, mom, if you want to go out with your nigga, that's cool. Like, you feel me? I'm just like, and I, and I told her, she know I'm smart. I said, yo, if you need me to put on, like, my headphones or anything, just let me know. She, what's that supposed to mean? I'm like, you know, if I need to put my headphones on, I'll, I'll put my headphones on. She, what, Sherrod? Punch me. She chill out, chill out, whatever. Just that's the that's the first time she punched me. At the end of the day, don't punch me because I know what sex is. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, that was crazy. That was not crazy, bro. I bro, if I say yo yo mom, you need me to put my headphones on. Let me know. Let me know. All right, cause look, look at it like this. Look at it like this. Look at it like this. Say I act like I didn't know. It's like, that's odd, right? No, it's not. It's honest. Because it's like, yo, if I need to put my headphones on, let me know. Because I already put my headphones on when y'all think y'all low at night. Y'all be thinking y'all low fucking at night. So it's like, I already might as well just keep it real. You feel me? I'm not saying let me stay in a room with you. I'm going to be in my own room, but I be hearing you. So it's like... Let me know, bro, if that's what it's about. Because she was a little angry. It's like, bro, why you that angry? That's not real school, nigga. I passed real school with A's. Chill. So it's like, now let's say I act like I didn't know. And while y'all fucking, I knock on your door and walk in. Then you really gonna be pissed. Then you really gonna be pissed. She wanna be, exactly, she wanna be loud. If you shut the fuck up at night, I wouldn't know. I don't even know... I be thinking like, yo, why your head board is hitting the wall? Do you think about me? Or are you just getting fucked? Do you think about how I feel every time your head board? What if I was an emotional child? What if I start crying or something? I was weird. What if I was like a weird, embarrassing, like I was embarrassed or like traumatized? What if that like, what if I had to go to therapy? I really don't give a fuck. I'll put my headphones on and forget and fall asleep to music. But like, come on, you be loud. Don't act, don't we not gonna play like I'm wilding out. You're wilding. You don't want to get fucked, not me. So, her mitt hitting the headboard. I don't know what's hitting the headboard, but the headboard hitting that wall. I don't know if his ankles, his his draw drops his ankles and he kicking that bitch, or if her head getting slammed into that bitch, or if they in the middle of the mattress and that bitch just shaking. I don't know. She, I don't know. She could be, she could be fucking him. I don't know. I don't really know what went on with the sex, but I know it's like, yo, yo, you're wilding. Something getting hit. You feel me? So I'm suspended for two days, bro. On the second day, I'm in a house all day. She like, you can't do nothing. I'm looking out the window. I don't know who the fuck this nigga parents and guardian is, but he's standing outside my crib looking in, doing this. I opened the window. I'm not a prisoner, nigga. I'm going to say what I got to say. The trip was two weeks. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, bro. You think you think you're doing something, bro? That's why I fucked you up. Just at 30, arguing with me. You're like, yeah, yeah, shut up, nigga. Grab a rock. Psh, throw it into the window. I'm like, yo. My, my mom like, what was that noise? He run. She, why you just break the window? I'm like, I did it. The boy just threw something. What boy? I don't, now I don't know the nigga name. I'm like, yo, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know his name. She, you don't know shit. 
You broke the window. Now I gotta pay a deductible. They gonna take my deal deposit. I'm like, I didn't do this stuff. I'm like, yo, just then the third. Now she, yo, stay in your room, yo. I'm starting to get mad. I'm like, yo, another hour passed. I look back out. He out the window. This is not me. I didn't do this stuff. <laughs> Bro, I look back at an hour. I'm looking. He out there. I'm like, I'm going to fuck you up, pussy. I open the window. It's not that far. Bro, he hitting little dances. Hitting dance moves. Shut up. Just that in the third. Shut up. I'm like, I'm going to fuck you up. It's not that far down. I could hang jump, but I'm not going to hang jump. I'm like, yo, I'm about to come out there. When I act like I'm about to come out there, my mom at the front door, she said, yo, you didn't, really, you ain't hear me, bro? Go in your fucking room. I'm like, I'm like, the ball out there, he trolling. I go out there, he not out there. Bro, I'm like, yo, I promise. She, all right, let's go to his stuff. We go to his cabin. Knock on the joint. His dad come out. Can I help you? We like, yo, your son trolling. Just in the third. My son has been in bed the whole time. He go back. He check. Bro, this nigga is in bed. Fake sleeping. This nigga door open. Yes, dad. I think your friend here to see you. I don't know. Were you outside his house? No. Third day come. We back at camp. It's two more days to camp. I see him. They make sure they make sure we stay separated the whole day. They make sure we stay separated the whole day. And my uh and my mom made me go to camp. I didn't want to go. I said last two days can I sit out? She said no. She like, you need to go there. You apologize to the teacher and enjoy, and enjoy your last two days. Because if you're here, I'm going to make you sit in your room. I said, yo, I'm going to sit in the room. She said, since you want to sit in the room, now you're not sitting in the room. Sit me in there, bro. You should have re-recorded him on your tracker, tablet. Yeah, I didn't ever think about that. Bro, we go there. I'm talking to the girl. Now he come to the table while I'm talking to the girl. You feel me? We supposed to be separated. He come to the table. He, yeah, I grew up with Ryan and stuff. I'm like, bro, move. You trying to be weird. He, yeah, when we grew up, he used to pee the bed all the time. I'm like, bro, shut up, bro. I don't even know you. Now she, <laughs> she laughing. She really? I said, I don't know this nigga. You know I, you know I don't know this nigga. She said, y'all play the same games. Just that in the third, like, from the same neighborhood. I never thought about She like, he like, yeah, he used to pee the bed. Just that in the third. I'm like, bro, stop fucking playing with me. I pushed this nigga. I'm like, stop playing with me. The teacher, why are you starting fights, right? Just that in the third. Move from the table. I'm like, this is my table. She, he moved from the table. Move me from my own table, bro. Move me from my own table. I move from the table. He look at me like this. I'm like, yo! I'm like, yo, I'm like, yo, he just looked at me. He did that on purpose. She... Did what on purpose? He, huh? Can I help you? Bro, just cook me. Just cook me, bro. I apologize to the teacher. I apologize to the teacher. I'm like, yo. I'm like, yo, I apologize to stand up there. I'm like, he called my mom and tell her I had a good day. He, that's your last, your last day tomorrow anyway. You did have a good day. You moved to stand up third. You, uh, you moved when I asked you to move. Oh, my fucking gosh. Uh, let's, let me hurry up, bro. I'll tell you how I beat this.
is the Wi-Fi. No, it's my. It's it's the uh the the cord that the cord that goes to the camera, like the thing is getting too hot. It's getting hot, so I gotta take it out and plug it back in. I don't know why it's getting hot though. I did the I did the twenty I did the uh the subathon with the with because I'm using a real camera right now. I used the subathon with the real camera. You feel me? I used I used this uh the camera for the subathon and I used it for the Young Chris stream and the DD stream. And we haven't ever been streaming that long. They trolling. You feel me? I don't know. Was it the same? Yeah, it's still the same computer. Yeah, it's the same everything. I don't know. I'm going to have to figure it out. How much I got to pay to see you thug, Sheik? That shit sound gay. I don't know, bro. The tent? Yeah, it's probably the tent. Bro, I go home. My mom like, yo, we got one last day. Pack your stuff up after camp tomorrow. We're going to go out for dinner. Then we're going to drive. We're going to drive back home. Just in the third. All that, right? Bro, the nigga, the nigga cabin is two cabins away. Now my mom let me walk through the house. She in a room with her nigga, just standing the third, all that. Y'all, I always wore turbans, bro. I always wore turbans. I put on my black turban. I tied it around my face. I looked up how to tie a turban around your face. I tied a turban around my face. Put on my black, my black long sleeve shirt with my blue pants and my, and my all black slides. And I go for a walk, bro. I go for a walk. You feel me? I, I put that on so that, you know, the kids are not allowed to walk around for their safety unless they're with, like, an adult. So while I'm taking a walk, bro, while I'm taking a walk, y'all know I see this nigga pissing? I see this nigga pissing. He just outside pissing. <laughs> it can't be. It can't be. What young boys say, bitch ass nigga, don't ever try it again. I'm like, no, I see this nigga. I'm like, I got you right where I want you. Oh, yes. Bro, don't ever, don't ever try it again. I'm like, bro, I got this nigga. Bro, he's pissing. It's toilets, bro. It's literally toilets. He outside pissing and he don't see me. After he piss, he sit on a log, he on his phone, all that, bro. All that. I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. I got you, bro. I got you, I got you, I got you. I say, yo, that's what I'm going to do. I walk, I walk the long way. You ever see somebody and you want to sneak up on them, so you walk the longest way possible to ensure the safest route. I walked all the way around the whole lake. I'm watching them as I walk across the lake. I'm walking across the lake, and I'm watching them just to make sure he's still there. He's still there. I get behind this nigga back. I'm about, like, I'm about, I'm about 10 meters back, but I'm behind him. But you got to think, it's not grass and sunshine. It's branches. It's branches, so I'm like, bro, he gonna hear me if I step on a branch or if I walk up at a leaf crack. Y'all, I get to the low of the low. I've been down, I get on all fours, bro. I get on all fours, and I'm doing this. I, st I stick my left hand first. I get, in I get into, like, racing stance. I held my breath. Boom! I run! I'm running! As soon as he turn around, boom! Headlock! I got the nigga tapping the fuck out like we play UFC. Oh my god, bro. I got him tapping out like we playing UFC. Oh my gosh! He didn't know what to do! And this was around the times I was learning how to yoke everybody, doing the jujitsu. Oh my god, he tapping out. He tapping out like a bad bitch in bed. Oh my, bro, he, bro, he tapping the fuck out. I'm like, mm -hmm, pussy, you want to play with me? You want to play with me? Full Nelson, bro. You probably could have spelt that shit out. I don't, 
bro. I don't even got the. I don't even. I don't even got the nigga in the in the in the uh the regular joint like this. I got him in a daily joint. My whole elbow. My whole el. Bro. Mm hmm. Call for your mama. Mm hmm. I got him in one of those. I'm like, oh, he don't know what to do, bro. That nigga, the nigga sitting on a log. I yoke the nigga. I'm yoking him. He tapping out. I'm like, mm-hmm. I'm like, you wanted to play with me, right? That was you that took my tablet. He know, man, I didn't take your tablet. I'm like, shut the fuck up. You too loud. Oh, he, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Please. I let it go a little bit. I'm like, that was you that took my tablet, right? He, I didn't take no. I'm like, that was you that took my tablet, right? He like, yeah, that was me. I took the tablet. I'm like, bro, stop fucking playing with me. I'm not no fucking bitch. Let him go. I walk off. As I'm walking off, I hear... Ch -ch 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 -ch. I hear footsteps. Nigga, grab me. Yoke me up. I'm like... Ah, bro, I'm... <laughs> I try to walk away like I was Vin Diesel. Ah! I try to walk away like I... Like, ha! <laughs> Uh. Bro, because when I walked away, he was on the ground like this. Bro, he got me in the yoke. I got my fingers in between, so I'm like, I could breathe a little bit. I'm like, I'm going to fuck you up. As soon as I get done, I'm going to fuck you up. Now he's squeezing so hard that my fingers is becoming a part of the choke. I pull my fingers out and make it worse. <gasps> It turned it up. I got about 10 seconds to get out this yoke. I'm counting 10. Nine. He yoking me, bro. This nigga probably would have killed me. Eight. I'm pulling. Seven. Six. It hurt because I'm trying to breathe. I'm, I'm trying to breathe. Bro, as soon as I get the one, I do this. I hold my breath. Bro, I could hold my breath underwater for two minutes. As soon as it was time to hold my breath, I stopped. I stopped trying to pull. Boom, 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 bro. Y'all know how flexible I am, bro. And I could, bro, I can bone, nigga. I could put my whole elbow behind my head, nigga. My, bro, my legs flexible, nigga. Y'all know I be sitting in weird positions, all that weird shit. I'm punching this, nigga. Boom, boom. They basically jams, nigga. Look at it in slow mo. Hush, hush. I'm hitting him. Boom. He not trying to let go. I'm sitting this nigga. I'm hitting this nigga hard. <sighs> but the more that the harder that I throw the punch, the more the more time I the more time I lose from like hold up. The harder I throw the punch, the more time I lose from um from holding my breath. Bro, he eating the punches. Next thing you know, I do boom bam. Boom, bam. Them joints start eating, bro. It start fucking him up, bro. It start fucking him up. He, I'm boom, 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 boom. I'm caving his shit the fuck in. Bro, after he let go, I turn around. Hangmaker. Boom. I'm, boom, bro. I'm hitting him with hard ass joints, bro. He dropped. He holding it, bro. He holding his fucking liver. I'm punching it. I'm punching shit in the fucking, bah, bah. Bah, bah, bah. I'm punching shit the fuck in, bro. His lip bleeding, bro. His nose bleeding. Like, blood is coming out his... Bro, blood is coming out his nose. His lip bleeding, bro. His eye like this. Bro. His eye like that. He holding his rib. I'm like, stop fucking playing me, young boy. <laughs> Spit on him. And I backed up this time. Because I'm like, yeah, if you come for me this time, I'm going to fuck you up. Bro, I get in the, I get in the house. My mom, I'm, I'm, my mom, like you good? I'm like, yeah, I went for a walk. This, that, and the third, right? I'm like, I went for a walk. She, damn. I'm like, yeah, I went for a walk. This, that, and the third. She, oh my god, what happened to your lip? I fell. She, you did not fall. Why your lip busted? I'm like, mom, I fell. She like, you did not fall. This, that, and the third. She rinsing off my lip. This, that, and the third. Y'all. Y'all. I go into my room. I go upstairs. I go into my room. When I get into the room, I see blood on my windowsill. 
I look out and I see this nigga had just dropped. And this nigga dropped. Like he hang jump. Like I don't know how he got up there, but he just now dropping as I get in. The nigga then took my fucking tablet. My mom walk in like, what's going on? I, but I'm already hopping out the window, hang jumping. I'm chasing him. Bro, he grabs my Samsung tablet, throws it into the lake. As he throw it in the lake, I'm still charging to him. Ah! Boom, spare him. We both go flying into the ground. Boom. He fall. Now I'm punching him. Ah! 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 My mom, ah, shit, I just hurt my hand. Damn, my knuckles super hurt. Um, Bro, I'm whooping this nigga ass. As I'm whooping niggas, this nigga ass, bro. My mom come out, get the fuck off him, you gonna kill him. His dad come out, what's going on? White, white, uh, white, white, black old head. Like, he black, but he white for real. I'm whooping this nigga ass, bro. With all due respect, I can't take you serious. Boy, you sound mad zesty. Um, maybe I'm not the channel for you. You could probably go, um, I know it's bodybuilders that do YouTube with deep voices. If that's if that's what matters to you, you probably can go listen to um or just search up deep voices maybe if the voice matters to you, and then you probably could take that serious. Um, anyways, bro, I'm whooping his ass. His dad come out, bro, and as his dad come out, bro, he what's going on? He oh my god, Brody basically on the ground like gave up, bro. He gave up late, bro. He come out he. Oh, we gotta get you to the ambulance. You boys was fighting. I got into a fight. It's okay. It's okay though. It's okay. My 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 mom like, oh my god, please don't press charges. He nah, I wouldn't think about it. Boys get into fights. He dead. Press charges. Press charges. Dad. He no, we can't press charges on this poor boy. I'm like, no, I don't want to press charges on you either. He, you can't press charges on me. You beat me up. I'm. <laughs> He dead, press charges, please. Bro, he begging his dad to press charges. <laughs> he begging his dad, he said, please. Anything I want, <laughs> please <laughs> just press charges. <laughs> My mom like, no, please, no. <laughs> he we're not pushing chargers. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> he throw his he throw his son in the car. <laughs> they drive into the ambulance. <laughs> they drive. <laughs> they drive into the. <laughs> <laughs> he drops it off. I'm cracking the fuck up because, bro, he begging. Bro, he put him in the back of the car. He put him in the back of the car. They drive it to the hospital. My mom said, yo, pack your stuff up now, 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 now. She make our boyfriend pack up. We leave that night instead of in the morning. I don't ever go for the last day, bro. I don't ever go for the last day, bro. We go home. My mom like, yeah, we're not taking you on any more trips. Like, we can't take you on no more trips. <laughs> she can't take you on no more trips. She told my mom what I did. My mom like, that's what his ass get. I told her the full story. Bro, when, when my mom, not the adult in, in question... When my mom, not the adult in question, she very sensible. When she's the adult in question, like, when she's under control, well, like, she ain't not trying to hear shit. She didn't beat my ass. My, 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 my god mom, like, she says she understand, but she, like, I embarrassed her, and I took her on that trip, and it became something, like, it, it was supposed to be her chill, and she should have just went by herself, but she invited me, like, she was mad or whatever, but... We made up in like a week or so. We made up. She said basically like, I shouldn't have been so mean. I should have just been his friend or, or a whore. 
or hear him out to hear him out No, she said to even start it because I'm like, yo, this started because I didn't want to be his friend. He was trying to hunt little kids. <laughs> no, nah, my tablet still was going, bro. She ain't buy me another one. I know. I know. I know. Let me move the camera to the desk.